from creepy women in trees uh, uh. Nah. to an unknown substance that infects towns yeah, that's just kind of gooey and stretchy it looks kind of like tar and bigfoot sightings that shocked everyone These are a few of the things we will look at, so stick to the end. Where are you at? I hear it. Imagine venturing into the depths of a forest at night, the darkness enveloping everything, and then encountering a sight that sends shivers down your spine. This video, although blurry, captures such a chilling moment. <gasps> Given its size and the setting, speculation runs wild. Could this be the legendary Bigfoot, often rumored to roam secluded forests? Or might it be a bear, its stature and eyes visible, just enough to be caught on camera? Alternatively, the skeptical mind might wonder if this is a clever hoax, designed to stir up fear or excitement. The ambiguity of the footage, combined with the eerie setting, fuels the mystery. The creature remains unidentified, its intentions unclear, and its reality uncertain. If I was the man filming this video, I would have ran away as fast as possible as the possibility of me being so close to such a creature during the night into the forest terrifies me. I hear it. A chilling scenario set deep within the woods at night was captured in this unnerving video. Hey! High up in one of the towering trees, an unexpected and horrifying sight unfolds. There, Amidst the dark silhouettes of the branches is a girl. But this is no ordinary scene of a child climbing a tree. It's something far more unsettling. The girl is screaming, her cries alarming all the residents, and her movements are erratic, almost as if she's thrashing or bouncing against her will. The scene gives off an intense feeling that she might be possessed, exhibiting behavior that's typically associated with horror tales of individuals overtaken by forces beyond their control. The entire spectacle is deeply unsettling, transforming the natural setting of the woods into a backdrop for a terrifying encounter. The video leaves me with a lingering sense of dread, and the uneasy question, what could have caused such a disturbing display? There is a substance straight out of a horror movie that no one has been able to explain even to this day. That's yeah, just kind of gooey and stretchy, it looks kind of like tar. This is what many beachgoers have noticed at South Carl. We're exploring a series of images and clips reporting on peculiar black sticky blobs appearing along the beach. These strange substances spark a wave of curiosity and intrigue, looking so out of this world that people can't help but wonder if they've stumbled upon something alien. The first accounts of this substance dates back to 1986 in Caracas, Venezuela, but it has been appearing every now and then, and there are cases of death from this unknown substance. The blobs are unusual and captivating, creating a buzz among locals and visitors alike. They're gooey and dark, contrasting starkly with the usual beach scenery, leading to all sorts of wild guesses about their origin. Could they be some bizarre form of sea life, pollution, or even evidence of extraterrestrial life? Despite almost two decades of study and millions of dollars spent identifying it, the cause of the substance has proven difficult, and there are still no definitive explanations as to how it appeared. I find this video very interesting, as I have never heard of this phenomenon, and it created a mystery yet to be solved. Embark on a mysterious journey into the forest at night, where the video at hand captures something truly unusual.
High up in the branches of one of the trees, there's movement that catches the eye. A black, hairy figure skillfully navigating through the limbs. The creature's presence is initially obscured by the dense foliage. But as the video continues, we get a clearer view. What emerges from behind the leaves is astonishing. The creature bears a striking resemblance to what many would identify as Bigfoot, a legendary being that's been the subject of folklore and countless eyewitness accounts. Whether this is a genuine sighting of the elusive Bigfoot or just a trick of the light and shadow in the forest remains open to interpretation. Yet, the video undoubtedly offers a fascinating and unsettling encounter with something extraordinary in the still of the night. I incline to think that this video is real, and the face of the creature with that creepy smile gives me shivers down the spine. We're introduced to a girl, seemingly engrossed in making a video, completely oblivious to the eerie occurrence unfolding behind her. As the camera rolls, an unusual and chilling spectacle emerges from behind the wall, just over the girl's shoulder. It's a translucent figure, but its presence is subtle, not drawing any immediate attention from the girl, which adds an even more sinister layer to the unfolding scene. Unexpectedly, the creature retracts, stopping short of actual touch. This moment of near interaction frightened me. Who knows what this creature might have done? It's as if I'm watching a scene from a horror movie, where the boundary between the ordinary and the paranormal is blurred, leaving me on edge and questioning what might happen next. I recently visited Lake Como, one of the deepest lakes in Europe, and I want to share with you some strange things the lake is known to have all sort of things at its bottom. As you can see in this clip, it is a graveyard for cars, tanks, warplanes, and all sort of things. But the lake is famous for something else, something creepier. It is said that somewhere at its bottom lies a monster called Lariosaro, similar to the one we all know at Loch Ness. The earliest sighting dates to 1946, Eyewitnesses allegedly reported seeing a reptile-like animal swimming in the waters of the lake. It is said to not be aggressive unless disturbed. However, folklore says otherwise, with some encounters being deadly. There are even earlier reports of its existence, dating as old as several hundred years, with old pictures immortalizing these claims. So if you want to visit Italy, I suggest you take a trip to this ancient lake as well. But be careful if you think of diving in the water. If you are enjoying this so far, consider subscribing. It really helps me keep this channel going. In this video, we're introduced to an extraordinary and somewhat unsettling creature that defies the usual expectations of wildlife. <laughs> At first glance, the creature's head resembles that of a dog, equipped with notably sharp teeth, suggesting a fierce nature. However, as the camera continues to record, it reveals that the rest of the creature is far from what one might anticipate following the canine-like head. Instead of a dog's body, the creature boasts a form that eerily mirrors a human's complete with a humanoid torso and an enlarged belly, which adds an unusual dimension to its appearance. The limbs are present, yet they deviate from the norm. The arms are devoid of hands, and the legs, although shorter, end in feet that bear a resemblance to human feet in their shape. The creature's skin is a distinct gray, enhancing its otherworldly look. Even more intriguing is the fact that, despite appearing unconscious, there are visible signs of breathing, making me anxious thinking about the possibility that it could wake up at any time and harm the person filming. I have no idea what this creature could be, but 
If you know, let us know in the comments. Imagine witnessing a scene that defies everything you know about fire and water. As the video plays, we see an individual attempting to extinguish this unusual fire with more water, intuitively thinking it will douse the flames. However, the fire only grows more intense with each attempt. This unexpected turn of events adds to the intrigue, leaving viewers puzzled and in awe. The spectacle of fire burning on water is a fascinating study in contrasts. Typically, water is the go-to extinguisher for flames, but here it seems to feed the fire instead of fighting it. This scenario might involve flammable substances floating on the water or underground gases feeding the flames from below, turning a simple act of nature into a captivating display of its complexity and mystery. I find this phenomenon extraordinary, giving life to the metaphor. Embark on a spine-tingling journey through a scene that might just challenge your beliefs in the ordinary. Out of nowhere, an eerie incident occurs. The woman's hair appears to be mysteriously pulled backward. Yet there's no one else in sight. No visible presence, no hands reaching out, nothing that could logically explain her hair's sudden movement. The room is still. The dog beside her remains undisturbed, oblivious to the strange event. This peculiar moment naturally stirs thoughts of the supernatural. Could this be the work of an unseen entity, a ghostly presence making itself known in the most unsettling way? The lack of any visible cause for the hair pulling intensifies the mystery, wrapping the scene in a cloak of the paranormal. Poor woman. If I were her, I would call a priest as soon as possible. Step into a moment of intrigue right at the entrance of a garage, where this video captures a peculiar and fascinating creature. Initially, it might seem like we're looking at a small black frog, a common enough sight in some areas. However, as the camera zooms in and we get a closer look, it becomes clear that this is no ordinary frog. The creature's head is elongated, straying from the typical round shape we associate with frogs. Even more intriguing is the absence of visible features we'd expect to see, like eyes or a mouth. This lack of identifiable characteristics adds a layer of mystery to the creature sparking curiosity about its true nature. The video leaves me pondering several questions. Is this an unusual species of amphibian? Perhaps a rare or less known variety? Could it be a creature in a transitional stage of its life? Or maybe it's something entirely different, defying our expectations of familiar wildlife. Imagine stepping into a farm field, the camera rolling, capturing the rustic charm of the countryside. Suddenly, the video zeroes in on an intriguing sight, a skunk cabbage, freshly uprooted, lying in the open field. This is a skunk cabbage that grows down along. This isn't just any ordinary glimpse of flora. What stands out is the extraordinary appearance of the plant, particularly its root system. As the camera focuses, the skunk cabbage reveals its otherworldly beauty. The roots are dense, intricate, and spread out in a complex network that captivates the viewer's attention. They exhibit an almost alien quality, as if this plant could belong to a landscape far removed from our earthly familiarities. The sheer uniqueness of the skunk cabbage, especially in its uprooted state, turns this simple video into a fascinating visual exploration. I am not familiar with this plant and seeing it for the first time in this video made me think of an alien plant at first. In this intriguing image from the Pyrin Mountains of southwestern Bulgaria, 
were presented with a captivating mystery embedded in stone. The photograph shows a man's foot placed beside a remarkable impression on a rock. A colossal footprint that seems to echo the shape of a human foot, but is magnified to an astonishing scale, at least eight times larger. The footprint's most striking feature is its toes, which bear a striking resemblance to those of a human, suggesting familiarity yet paired with the unknown. The rest of the footprint, however, veers into the realm of the mysterious, with proportions and contours that don't quite match our expectations of a human foot, hinting at a creature of extraordinary size and perhaps unknown origin. The mind races with possibilities. Could this be evidence of giants, as suggested by myths and legends that span cultures and eras, creatures of immense stature whose existence has faded into folklore, or might this imprint hint at the existence of Bigfoot? The elusive creature reported in various sightings throughout the world, yet remaining shrouded in skepticism and mystery? This image left me with more questions than answers, and I am very curious of knowing what could have left such a mark, and if the creature still exists. If you got so far in the video, it means you're a dedicated viewer. Thank you, and if you subscribe and hit the bell button, I promise to keep posting these for you to enjoy. Imagine encountering a creature so unusual it seems to challenge the laws of nature itself. This tiny reptile, with its pair of heads atop a single body, appears as if plucked from a realm of fantasy or a mythical story. This rare condition, known as bicephaly, is a form of conjoined twinning, but is exceptionally uncommon in reptiles. The two heads sharing one body might make you think of mythical creatures or beings from a realm of fantasy. Yet here it is, a living turtle that defies common natural expectations. It is fascinating how these animals with bicephaly can live without problems. They give us a rare glimpse of nature's diversity. Step into a scene that blurs the line between the familiar and the utterly mysterious. This video, captured on a Texas beach, presents us with a creature that defies easy categorization. Imagine being on Bolivar Beach and this turns up. KH11 viewer Patricia share It kind of looks like an anemone you'd find in the ocean, with lots of tentacles that are soft and jelly-like. But here's where it gets super weird. The creature's mouth. It's big and looks super scary. Kind of like the mouth of a sea lamprey, but even larger. This isn't something you'd want to bump into while swimming. The creature's color is another strange thing. It's gray, which isn't what you'd expect for something like an anemone. This unusual color makes it look even more out of the ordinary. So what is this thing? Is it just a strange kind of anemone? Or is it something we've never seen before? The video leaves me guessing, showing me just how many weird and wonderful things there might be out there that we still don't know about. Embark on an up-close exploration of one of nature's more ethereal creations, captured in this video where a man holds a fascinating creature in his hand. The fish's mouth is notably sharp and pointed, resembling an arrowhead, which adds to its unusual and striking appearance. This pointed mouth is likely an adaptation to its natural environment helping it catch its prey in the cold waters it usually inhabits. Transparency in fish, like that seen in the ice fish, is an extraordinary adaptation. It's often a form of camouflage, making the fish nearly invisible to predators and prey in the water. Despite being out of water in this video, the ice fish retains its see-through appearance, allowing us to marvel at its unique physiology up close. This type of fish 
is a very interesting sight to see. And thanks to the video, we have the opportunity to dive in the diversity of the nature. Imagine peering through the lens of a ring camera, typically a silent guardian of the night, when it captures a surprising visit right at the front of a house. As the night unfolds in front of the camera, we see these two coyotes up close, engaged in a rather domestic act. They're feasting from an animal food bowl left outside. But the feast is interrupted when one of the coyotes becomes aware of the camera's presence. As the animal pauses, its eyes possibly catching the camera's glint, or sensing its unusual nature in their familiar foraging ground. In an unexpected twist, the coyote's response is to take action. It decides to claim the camera itself, perhaps as a trophy or out of sheer curiosity, grabbing it in its mouth and making off with it. I personally enjoy seeing how animals react to human environment and gadgets, how curious they get and how they interplay with our daily life objects. Step into the quiet world of a field at night, observed through the watchful eye of a trail camera. The deer turns to face the camera directly, and what unfolds next is a captivating display. It begins to move its hind legs in an unusual manner, almost as if it's performing a dance. This peculiar behavior is fascinating, seeming as though the deer is aware of the camera's presence and has decided to put on a show, or perhaps it's engaging in a natural behavior that just happens to resemble a dance. This unexpected dance could be a spontaneous display of playfulness or a rare behavior triggered by the deer's interaction with its environment, possibly even a response to the infrared light or the slight sound from the camera. I find this video very interesting as it seems like the deer is aware that it is being filmed and decided to set up a show. Step into a moment filled with a mix of amusement and concern captured in this video, where we observe the often clumsy yet endearing world of a panda bear. <laughs> Pandas, with their iconic black and white fur, are creatures that exude a sense of charm that's hard to resist, and this particular panda is no exception. However, instead of a graceful ascent, the panda finds itself in a precarious situation, dangling from a slender branch. This incident, while somewhat humorous, subtly underscores a more serious note. Pandas are known for their laid-back, almost lazy demeanor which, combined with their specialized bamboo diet and low birth rate, contributes to their status as an endangered species. While it's easy to chuckle at the panda's misadventure, it's also a reminder of their vulnerability and the importance of ongoing conservation work to protect these unique animals. I think these animals are so fragile and need protection, as I think all of us still want them and their cuteness around. This video, captured by a kayaker, thrusts us into a startling scenario I know no one would want to be in. The kayaker, isolated in the vastness of the ocean, finds themselves in a heart-pounding situation. The water's surface, once a picture of calm, now betrays the movement of something immense lurking below. The suspense is palpable, as viewers can only imagine the size and nature of the creature causing such a disturbance. With my thalassophobia, I could never go into such deep waters with my kayak. But the video left me wondering, what could cause such a wave? An eerie setting becomes the backdrop for a chilling video that's bound to leave a lasting impression 
on anyone who dares to watch. The drone glides silently, its camera capturing the solemn tranquility of the cemetery below. Then, something unexpected and unsettling enters the frame. Beside one of the graves, a shadowy presence becomes apparent. It's not just any shadow. This one is unique. It appears as a translucent figure, a specter that moves with an otherworldly grace. This ghostly apparition doesn't seem bound by the laws of the physical world, and its presence in such a sacred and solemn place amplifies the eerie atmosphere. The sight of this shadowy figure, captured so clearly yet so mysteriously by the drone, sends me shivers down the spine. Our forests hold mysteries and fascinations beyond our comprehension, and sometimes humans stumble upon things that boggle the mind. In this video, a hiker makes a confusing discovery, a strange looking creature in the heart of the forest at night. At first glance, it resembled a bobcat, but upon closer inspection, the creature's weird features became apparent. Though it had bobcat-like ears, its face was unusually wide, and the gap between its eyes raised eyebrows. What truly sends shivers down my spine is the creature's intense stare at the hiker. The eyes exude an eerie, almost evil quality leaving a chilling impression that its intentions might not be as innocent as they seem. Ever heard the advice to climb to a high place if you encounter a bear? Well, this video might make you think twice. Recorded by villagers, the footage unfolds with a group of men standing on the roof of a house, looking visibly frightened. One of them is wielding a long piece of log, presumably to fend off an approaching threat. Suddenly, the cause of their fear enters the frame. A hefty bear. The bear, determined and unfazed, climbs on the wheat stacks and uses them as a makeshift ladder to reach the roof. Witnessing this, panic ensues and everyone starts sprinting for their lives. The bear, seemingly irritated or agitated, picks a target and chases them off the roof. Despite the tense situation, some villagers appear to be smiling, suggesting they may have experience dealing with such bear encounters and knew how to handle the situation. Witnessing large structures like buildings or bridges collapse can evoke intense fear because it's something beyond our control. In this video, we see a dramatic scene unfold in India where a bridge collapses, creating massive waves in the water below. The footage captures not only the bridge's collapse, but also the reactions of hundreds of onlookers standing on a boat, watching the event unfold. As the bridge crumbles, it sends colossal waves rushing towards the observers on the boat. The sudden shock hits them, realizing the danger they're in. Understanding the precarious situation, everyone swiftly starts disembarking from the boat, and the video comes to an end. The sheer length of the collapsing bridge, and the way it sends waves through the water below, add an extra layer of terror to the scene. Ever wondered who'd come out on top in a face-off between four domestic dogs and a hefty wild seal? Well, this video spills the beans. It captures the scene of four dogs encircling a massive seal, barking up a storm. The dogs display clear signs of aggression, but the seal remains surprisingly calm. After a bout of relentless barking, the dogs decide to back off. That's when the seal, seemingly unimpressed, decides it's time for payback. As the dogs turn away, the seal takes action, opening its mouth and attempting to take a bite at one of the dogs nearby. Luckily for the dog, it manages to evade the seal's bite, and that's where the video wraps up. 
Seals are typically known for their calm and gentle nature, but as seen in this video, when provoked, they certainly have their own unique ways of seeking revenge. When animals interact with the human world and human inventions, there are times when we get some unusual reactions out of them. Take these two foxes, for instance. While fighting each other, they ended up on the trampoline where they continued their fight until they realized where exactly they were. So one of them started jumping on it and enjoying it. But the other one wasn't ready to call off the fight, hence it started again. But the first fox was so invested in exploring what the trampoline was and how it worked that it could not help but focus only on that. The video ended because maybe the person recording got tired of holding the camera, but the foxes were still there, enjoying their trampoline just like they should. Imagine being with your family on a boat, and you see a huge great white shark right below the surface of the water, as close to you as possible. Anyone would get scared, but this family found it more exciting than terrifying as they kept recording the shark moving around right below them and eventually leaving after deciding that it should leave these humans alone. The shark could have easily tipped the boat over if it wanted to, but fortunately it wasn't in the mood for any kind of violence and therefore left them all alone after giving them a glimpse of how terrifyingly unpredictable the ocean can be. This mesmerizing clip of a tsunami was recorded by a camera specifically placed to record such weather phenomena is something that can leave anyone who watches it awestruck. The way the downpour starts off from the mountains and then descends to the hills, the lake, and finally onto the houses with all its glory, and the way the cloud shapes and the angle it has all been captured from make this clip one of its kind. And we all can see this absolute wonder of nature while relaxing in our cozy places, thanks to the inventions of cameras. I've found this image online, with the user claiming they have captured this on trail camera. It is no question what the first thought anyone would have. That is the face of the legendary Bigfoot, its face fully covered in brown hair, a large nose perhaps for a body just as big. On the other hand, its eyes seem to convey also a gentleness. Could this image be real or fake? Is it the real face of the legendary creature? A large and ominous looking predator emerges from the right into the camera frame moving almost too quickly to focus on it, disappears in seconds from view. A chance encounter of a lifetime occurs when this person captures what appears to be a creature of legend known as the Almasty or Snowman of the Caucasus. This cousin to Bigfoot and the Yeti is believed to roam the Caucasian wilds. Approximately six feet tall with red or black fur, the creature is believed to have slanted eyes that glow red in the dark. In a strange bounding leaping gait, it proceeds to tear through the forest as if in pursuit of something we cannot see. The cameraman manages to capture a clear glimpse of it just before it disappears. These mysterious beasts can move at 37 miles per hour and resemble something between an ape and a Neanderthal. Watch as the creature almost jumps from one step to another. Had this unsuspecting voyeur been spotted, it would be unlikely that they'd manage to escape at the pace the creature is able to pursue its prey. A man films a live video of himself walking around a seemingly deserted ship deck at night. No sooner has he started filming when his eyes grow wide with surprise. He turns the phone camera to the water, and it takes a moment to realize that we aren't seeing something but hearing it. At first, it sounds like the wail of a child in the distance, but with every repeated sound, it becomes something far more abstract and eerie. I hear. Where's she at? 
What the fuck is that? No he breaks into a run, moving to the hull of the ship to get closer to the sound. This time, a distinct series of calls are heard coming from the darkness beyond. Something or someone throws its voice as if responding to him. That's crazy. Later, he posts a replay of his live video, calling out to the voice. A clear response is heard from the distance as he balances precariously to get as close to the sound as possible. Can you hear me? <laughs> Yo, that shit was instantaneous, bro. Oh, I gotta watch my step out here, man. Listen to its distinct call just a second before he calls out again to it. The voice appears to be coming from two places at once. What is this strange call? There does not appear to be another boat in close proximity. Could it be a ghost from some long, forgotten shipwreck? Or the mythical mermaid, like sirens who lured sailors with their haunting song, only to have them drown when their boats capsized on the rocks? In this video, we're taken on a late night drive through a forest, seen from the perspective of a passenger filming the journey. Everything changes when they have to slam on the brakes. Right there, in the middle of the road, is something you'd never expect. A strange figure that looks human, standing still, cloaked in black from head to toe. The driver tries everything to get it to move. He honks the horn, shouts, and even inches the car closer. But this cloaked figure just won't budge. It's like it doesn't even notice them. Finally, deciding enough is enough, the driver steps out of the car, determined to confront this mysterious roadblock. But here's where it gets really weird. When he reaches out and pulls the cloak away, there's nothing there. No person, no object. Nothing that could explain how this cloak was standing upright in a perfectly human shape. It's as if they've encountered a ghost or some kind of invisible force. To me, this is seriously spooky stuff. How does a cloak stand in the middle of the road like it's wrapped around someone? But when you check, there's nothing there. In this fascinating video, a man is seen interacting with a freshly captured, still alive piranha. Holding the fish securely in his hand, he decides to test the famed cutting ability of its teeth. He takes a stick and inserts it into the piranha's mouth, curious to see if the small but notorious fish can indeed slice through it. Remarkably, each time the stick is placed in the mouth, the fish quickly cuts it, demonstrating the incredible strength and sharpness of its teeth. This experiment is repeated multiple times consistently cutting through the stick effortlessly. It's a clear demonstration of the power packed into the jaws of such a small creature. Watching this, I'm struck by the sheer adaptability and specialized traits that evolution has bestowed upon creatures. <laughs> if you've ever been in a house that is creepy after dark and you are alone, you will understand what this young woman is going through. After a move to Ohio, she begins experiencing what can only be described as a kind of haunting or visitation by an unknown and deeply disturbing entity. Puzzle I'm working on. Maybe when I'm done with it, I can send you this. Um, Mom, I gotta go. There are a few interesting things about what we've just watched. There is a general sense of unease emanating from the young woman before we even hear the loud thump. She keeps glancing in the direction of somewhere off camera, and she almost swallows her word when showing off her puzzle. She seems nervous right off the bat, 
and is trying hard to keep upbeat for her mother. The next video provides clear evidence that while she might think she's alone in the house, she's not. Um, there's the oven. It's kind of whack, but I put the nice towel that you sent me. Thank you. As we just saw, she resumes the conversation, trying to keep a facade that everything is okay. She has moved to another room, perhaps somewhere she feels safer. The old oven seems to suggest that the house is slightly older, which adds to the creepiness of what follows. The story escalated quickly, as does the young woman's composure. She is no longer trying to put on a brave face. She is distraught as the house is bathed in darkness. Terrified, she lets on that it's back which suggests that this is not the first time something like this has happened. I think, I think it's back. The terrifying climax appears at the end with a shadowy figure only made visible by two glowing eyes. The story ends with the return of a thumping sound, which we now know is whatever that entity is, knocking on the front door. She pleads with it to no avail as it continues to stand and stare at her like a psychopath. <laughs> Whether truth or fiction, it makes for a frightening scenario. Two men returning to what appears to be a deserted and isolated house at night. It is unclear if the home is there's possibly abandoned due to what follows or merely a site of strange activity. Either way, their behavior is odd. Pulling up, one of them focuses his flashlight at the windows. Pay close attention or you just might miss it. Holy f***. What? Go, 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 go. Most towns have one creepy, deserted old house that has given way to neglect. Perhaps the owners grew old and died. Perhaps something terrible happened there. This is one of those houses. Note the tall grass out front. The air of abandonment. And then, so quick, you almost miss it. The figure of a small boy standing in the doorway. Why is he there? What nightmare unfolded behind those walls? Why is he trapped, unable to leave? The men seem to know that the house has a reputation. They do not get out of the car, even when it is clear the figure is the height of a child they do not stop to investigate. Instead, they speed off into the night, leaving us to wonder what really happened there. Watch again in the zoomed-in footage. Illinois zoomed in and surprisingly clear footage captures something utterly terrifying amongst the trees. At first sight it is barely detectable, but then a figure emerges. A hulking bipedal creature stands almost as tall as the trees in the snow-covered landscape. Spotted, it begins to move. Is this a hoax or further compelling evidence to suggest that Bigfoot really exists? The scale of the creature positioned amongst the trees and the confident manner it moves in this snowy wilderness suggests that this is its home. The overall shape of the creature and the almost conical head add to the case for this being real. On being discovered, it vanishes into the trees. Chilling at home alone shouldn't be this stressful. Watch what happens in this unsuspecting encounter that really is too close for comfort. I'm home alone, right? But... A ghostly reflection of what looks like a woman with long dark hair or something pulled over its head appears alongside the poster of the video. Shot in a seemingly continuous point of view, the image is quite terrifying, but her response to the moment is anything but. Perhaps I'd be more convinced if she wasn't so calm to her invisible flatmate. Her demeanor does little to suggest shock or horror. Does the poster just have nerves of steel? Or is it a hoax born of some editing? You be the judge. We see a lot of poor footage of Bigfoot online. 
which makes the videos we're showing in this episode something of an exception. This one, although zoomed in, seems to capture the creature in fairly close proximity. Pay attention to the movement of this Bigfoot. It has a somewhat different gait to others we've seen. Could this relaxed stride be due to the fact that the creature is unaware that it has been discovered? Or is that the most epic Halloween costume? On Trail Terror, we feature a number of clips of animals in their natural habitat, particularly deer and elk during rutting season. These animals display a diverse number of vocalizations that serve to not only attract mates, but warn others of danger. A Texas police officer stops at a rest stop and records the following sound emanating from the woods beyond. What is initially noticeable is the sheer volume of the bellow. It feels almost otherworldly. Could this be the call of a really large stag or elk? Or as this police officer suggests, the cry of Bigfoot? This startling footage claims to capture the face of Bigfoot. The likeness to human features is incredibly disturbing, but the more you look at the sheer size of its head and the somewhat large gap between its round eyes, these features resemble something less human. Here, the creature seems relaxed and even curious as it glances in the direction of the camera. It knows it's being watched, but in turn it is watching. In other videos, Bigfoot hunters claim that these creatures often have one member who serves as a lookout to protect its family. We have showed earlier videos on this channel where similar close-ups of Bigfoot's face have been captured, but the picture quality has not been as clear. This face confirms the face captured in other sightings, supplying a compelling case for its existence. This mesmerizing and rare footage captures a close-up human encounter with a mountain lion. Watch as the poster and his family come across the calm cat on their walk. Fortunately, the kitty isn't in the mood to rip their faces off. In most eventualities, mountain lion attacks on humans are not that common. If they wanted to hunt us, they would. Having said that, never play submissive to a cougar if you wish to survive. The glorious creature remains relaxed and still as the humans admire her beauty. Someone climbing up the wall. It's an ice man. It's a ghost. Jesus, what is that? This somewhat poor quality footage captures a humanoid shape scaling the rock on a mountain without any kind of safety equipment or clothing for that matter. The creature shows remarkable pace and agility as it moves effortlessly further up the mountain face. Is this a nudist rock climber out getting his kicks? Or is it something more sinister? The creepy, almost ghostly white skin suggests it should be avoided. Did we mention that mountain lion attacks on humans are rare but not impossible? And that you should never run if being pursued by one but fight back if needs be? Watch this heart-stopping footage of a trail runner being pursued by the big cat. Oh shit! Hey! Luckily, he has the wherewithal to assert dominance or that might have been the end of him. Two ghostly figures are captured in this footage taken at Yosemite. The weird creatures resemble a type of cryptid but instead of the elongated body they have no real torso, mainly legs and a featureless head where no eyes, nose, ears or mouth are apparent. Note the one-dimensional nature of their shape and profile, the stilted walk that shifts to an almost ghost-like floating movement. The figures lurch down the hill in a bizarre fashion, twirling in a creepy dance before disappearing from the frame. Apart from location, there is not much more to go on. If you know what these are, let us know in the comments. In general, malls are seldom the first choice for a paranormal fright night. Those are relegated to creepy old houses or deserted museums. However, The Last of Us changed that with its utterly enchanting 
and terrifying mall scenes. As did this video, a night duty security guard in a deserted mall after hours has a seriously disturbing shift. It begins with sound disturbances that provide no explanation for what has caused them. It's creepy, man. You're so freaking creepy. Just... Followed by a creepy encounter with a paranormal entity in the food court. Watch, she captures the impossible on camera before getting the hell out of there. Freaking chair just moved. What the sh Okay. I'm done, I'm done. Clearly, no salary is worth this kind of harassment. A peaceful night at home. A woman prepares for bed when her dog spots something or someone lurking in the shadows, just beyond the living room. Here I go to bed myself. What the f is that? What? Oh God! F if their reaction and hers are anything to go by, this isn't a hoax. Watch closely as the apparition appears for mere seconds before vanishing again. We're bringing you some really clear and compelling Bigfoot sightings in this episode of Trail Terror. Watch as this unsuspecting person spots the bipedal creature with its characteristic reddish fur in close proximity. There is the briefest moment where the two face, the beast alerted to the camera person by their panicked shouting. Fortunately, the shy Bigfoot disappears into the forest, avoiding confrontation. A TikToker who posts videos of strange events happening around her home was startled at the sound she heard while putting her chicks away in the pen. What the fuck? The sound coming from the forest was like an animal's cry for help. And so she shined her torchlight into the woods while recording. She captures a white figure next to a tree. At first glance, it wasn't there, but when she circled back to look in the same direction, her camera was able to capture a thin white figure at the left side of a tree. The strangest thing was that the figure disappeared after being out of the camera's recording range. Could it be that the mysterious white figure was making those eerie sounds in the forest? Or could it have scared an animal in the woods and caused it to make the bizarre sound? On a clear day, a man happens to capture what looks like Bigfoot casually walking out through a small clearing of a forest and back into the woods. The creature's features may prove it to be Bigfoot as it walks on twos and appears much more prominent than the average human height. Its arms extend downwards below the waistline and seem to have a thick coat of brown fur. The video quality isn't as clear and makes it hard to make out what the face looks like but its tall, towering stature, long ape-like arms, and the appearance of thick fur could be an indication of the existence of the cryptid Bigfoot. In this captivating video, shot from within the depths of the woods, we're presented with a sight that is both extraordinary and mystifying. Hidden among the greenery of the trees and vegetation, the footage reveals the presence of small, skinny, humanoid figures. These creatures are depicted as naked but lack any defining sexual characteristics, adding to their enigmatic nature. The appearance of these beings raises immediate questions about their identity. Are they goblins, as suggested by their diminutive and slender forms, which seem to belong more to the realm of folklore and myth than our modern world? Or could the footage be the result of computer-generated imagery designed to create a convincing illusion of their existence. This video shows a really close and kind of scary moment between a person on a snowmobile and a bear. The video, shot on a snowmobile's camera, takes place in a snowy area. There we see a big bear running, trying to get away from something. The snowmobile with the camera is chasing the bear and another snowmobile is circling around it. As the snowmobile with the camera gets close to the bear, the bear gets annoyed and tries to attack. 
person on the snowmobile skillfully dodges the bear's attack. This was a really close call, but we don't know why these people were chasing the bear, as the bear was clearly not happy about it and tried to get away. It was a really close and scary moment with the bear. Having a companion dog with you when venturing into a forest for hiking can be crucial for your safety, and this video provides a compelling example of why. The footage recorded by a hiker shows a forest trail with a black figure standing on the other side. The figure seems to notice the hiker recording and begins to flee. The hiker's dog reacts by barking at the figure, causing it to retreat even faster. No, Ziggy, no! The creature is described as humanoid, with a strong built body covered in thick black fur, resembling a Bigfoot. The presence of the dog played a key role in deterring the creature and ensuring the hiker's safety. It prompts the consideration of what might have happened if the hiker didn't have a dog with them. The protective instincts of a canine companion can make a significant difference in encounters with wildlife, providing an added layer of security during outdoor adventures. This video is from a beach, showcasing the discovery of a peculiar siren-like creature washed up on the shore. The footage begins with a view of the beach scattered with washed up wood branches. The camera then focuses on a dried up, eerie looking body. Upon closer inspection, the creature appears to resemble a mermaid with long feminine hair on its head. The lower half of the creature resembles that of a fish, while the upper body resembles a human. However, there's a possibility that this could be a fake or a prop deliberately placed there by someone. The suspicion arises because the creature's appearance suggests it might be a wooden model created for a specific effect. Regardless of its authenticity, the creature in the video does convey a creepy and unsettling vibe. This video was caught by a hunter who was bothered by these sounds. It is obviously an animal of some sort. Perhaps in distress or maybe giving warning sounds, this is one of the creepy noises you're ever likely to hear, particularly if you're alone somewhere remote at night. This sounds have caused a wave of speculation as it has captured imagination of many wondering what it could be. Most have suggested this to be from a maybe a moose or an elk. What do you think? Is it the mating call of a randy moose, a trapped bobcat, or something more sinister? Let us know your guesses in the comments below. This is a clip of a really unnerving scene. From far you might think your mind is playing tricks on you until we zoom on the strange figure. It looks like a really tall humanoid shadow is holding onto the pole beside it. It is something unfamiliar and out of the ordinary, and I have never seen anything like it examining its physique. Our attention is drawn to its elongated limbs and stretched out body. Could it be a person dressed in all black, possibly to cause speculation? A shadow of something tall causing a glitch in the camera, or an optical illusion created by certain lighting conditions, or in an eerie case, we could be in a presence of some sort of spirit. This video was recorded by a person who claimed the area to be infested by an anomaly, the Bigfoot. He was daring enough to take an adventure in the middle of the woods at night alone, and is met by something lurking in the dark. As he shines his flashlight into the forest, he sees the reflection of the eyes of a big animal relentlessly staring at him. Okay, I need to figure out what this thing is before we go any further. <clears throat> There he is, right there. See him? This sends chills down his spine. Just then, 
A towering pale shadow swiftly passes between the trees going in the right side. We cannot understand what the figure is due to the darkness. Our attention immediately shifts from the uncanny presence to the queer sounds that rent the air. Well, I think this could be just a mere mountain lion out in the night hunting for a snack. This camera caught a Bigfoot in 2015. Although the video is low quality, the details are pretty visible. The massive creature, covered in a rich coat of black hair, can be seen walking towards a certain point. It stops, and one can see it extending its really long arms towards the tree trunk. At the same moments, it starts to shake the tree with sheer strength. It is both awe-inspiring and terrifying at the same time. It leaves the tree and proceeds to another. What was the Bigfoot doing with the trees? Was it trying to take the tree down? Or it could be some sort of communication between Bigfoot entities? The local authority in this area had detected some movement on a private property and went on to check what it was, only to see this. Hey! You're on private property! He immediately stops when he sees a furry figure stalking amidst the bushes. This startles him. A form of light can be seen flickering in the bushes. Suddenly, the figure emerges from a thicket. It is enveloped by a dense covering of hair. Due to the low lighting in the footage, we cannot see its face, but what is visible is its short stature. As if agitated, this figure starts approaching the person recording, and this frightens him, and he turns to retreat in the other direction. I wonder what this thing could be. Supposedly a Bigfoot, or just a really creepy intruder. This security camera caught this very scary occurrence at a certain checkpoint. A car can be seen approaching the security checkpoint. As it stops, something seems to be really strange. The car appears to have no driver at all. And the guard surely notices this, all these weirdness. He gets out to investigate what really could be going on. Suddenly, something on the roof of the car terrifies the daylights out of him and he drops to the ground in panic as he scrambles away. Our attention shifts to the apparition on the car. It seems to be pretty real to me. Due to the darkness, I can't make out what this strange figure is, but it is surely scary from the guard's reaction. These two uncanny events truly perturb one. Where was the driver? And what's the creature on the roof? Could be witnessing a ghost driver. These two guys were out for a walk when they recognized something moving between the trees. As one of them continues recording, we can see a creature's head bobbling up and down as it walks. Oh shit. Oh my, my god. What is that thing, man? I didn't know it was that fing big. It's not coming up here, is it? No, it's... I didn't think it recognizes, man. Calm down, be quiet. Shortly, it emerges. A black enigmatic figure. It is really immense that the people recording exclaim with astonishment. It is not aware of the people watching it, and it casually strolls away. From the huge steps it is taking, I think it's a really tall creature. This bipedal subject seems to be enveloped in a thick coat of fur. Do you see how it's walking while arms hang down its side? This depiction aligns with the general perception of the Bigfoot. This homeowner was in his roof, repairing a faulty cable when he seemed to see something lurking in the shadows. When this footage is slowed, upon closer scrutiny, we can see an unknown figure that seems to be stalking. Then suddenly, it lunges back to its hiding place. The man surely spots it 
and immediately scurries away not wanting to know what this frightening creature could be. This could be a raccoon or a small furry animal. The residents of this house had been receiving unexpected guests in their home. Their visits were now a nuisance. So he decided to film this encounter. We can see him closing the door, and after he goes back, the door opens, and what's shocking is that there is no one behind the door. His dog is aware of this weirdness and barks in confirmation that there might be an intruder. He closes the door one more time, and the same happens. Little buddy. But this time, an unearthly humanoid figure can be seen in the darkness down the fleet of stairs when we zoom at the door. This is very scary, and as if it is not enough, the door closes itself, and when opens, the queer subject shapeshifts into a really enigmatic figure. This is spine chilling. The quality of this video is impressive, and I don't think it's edited. The dogs in the house were going crazy. Were they seeing something paranormal unseen to the human eyes? But surely something very creepy could be roaming in this household. This hunter has been on the trail for Bigfoot, and he disclosed a footage that claims to be entailing on the Sasquatch. This is the grassland where he caught the infamous creature. As he records, within the tall grass, a brown-haired creature appears and seems to be walking bipedally towards the left. It has a huge frame and a towering height. This description perfectly fits the Bigfoot characteristics, but maybe it could be a lost orangutan roaming in the area, or a man in a costume performing a hoax just to cause a show. In this distressing video from a surveillance camera, we see a house's courtyard where a puppy is playfully exploring. The calm scene takes a sudden and alarming turn when the puppy, venturing close to a bush, is attacked by a snake. The snake quickly wraps itself around the puppy, creating a perilous situation. The tension escalates as the puppy struggles to free itself. Soon, a mother and her daughter, witnessing the frightening scene, rush to the puppy's aid. Their attempt to rescue the dog is fraught with urgency and difficulty as they work to remove the snake. After a tense struggle, they finally succeed in freeing the puppy from the snake's grasp. It's a relief to see the puppy save, a reminder of the importance of vigilance in protecting our beloved animals. In this video, two men document their experience in a forest. They start by describing how, during a hunting trip, they encountered what they initially thought was a gigantic bear standing on two feet. So we're 4.6 from the truck and that's the closest road. I'm coming down here, I'm beat, get my gear off, get ready to eat. All of a sudden Eric's like, oh my gosh, big bear, big bear. I grab my bow, I raise up, I look down the hill and it is the freaking tallest bear walking on two legs I've ever seen in my life. As the situation unfolds, they quickly realize that this is no ordinary bear leading them to speculate that it might be Bigfoot. The video includes footage from one of the men's cameras showing a tall, hairy, black creature sitting on two feet. The men then attempt to chase the creature, hoping to capture clearer footage, but they ultimately fail in their pursuit. The video, with its glimpse of the mysterious creature and the men's excitement and determination to follow it, leaves an unsettling feeling. The idea of coming across something so unusual and potentially legendary like Bigfoot is both thrilling and intimidating. This encounter in the forest adds to the lore of mysterious creatures that continue to intrigue and puzzle us. In the following footage, a remote control drone is taken out for a spin in Salt Fort State Park, Ohio. As the pilot takes it out on a test run practicing its hovering capabilities, he unintentionally captures footage of a large dark figure lurking amongst the trees. Pay attention to the left side of the screen. The footage is easily missed. 
it looks like a large black dot. But watch as the video is enhanced with a spotlight. The figure becomes unmistakably clear. The drone is eventually lowered to the ground, and the unsuspecting pilot comes to claim it was completely unaware that only a few feet away this hulking creature is standing, more than likely aware of him, listening to him, watching him. His spectator, he, he's not standing that far away. Not far enough for me. What do you think? Is this footage authentic? A bright and warm summer day. This poster is enjoying time out in nature, but they are not the only ones soaking up the sunshine. Watch what becomes visible when they spot a shape in the distance. Zooming in with the full capacity of the phone camera, a familiar figure is recorded resting against a tree. Recognize the ape-like features, the color of its fur. Imagine its size if this video was filmed and zoomed in from some distance. Imagine you're hiking through the woods with your dog. Suddenly you become aware that you are not alone. Just beyond, in a clearing through the trees, you spot a large dark shape resting on a tree stump. In this footage, the poster appears to capture something large, black, and covered in fur. The quality of the video is poor, but a shape is visible, as are its movements for a fraction of a second. Beyond this, it's anyone's guess, whether it's Bigfoot or a bear. He's moving, he's moving, he's moving. Daisy, come here. Daisy, come here. All we have to go on is the conviction of the poster's claim and the rising fear in his voice as he calls out to his dog. For more strange and interesting footage, check this out.